Uh, thanks for visiting our YouTube channel. Uh, if you've not done so already, uh, make sure if you like it, make sure you click like to this this uh, video, and also click subscribe as well, so you'll be notified of any new uh, tutorials, any new videos or reviews that we uh, we do. Okay, so again, a number uh, of weeks ago. Um, when we were doing one of our Q&A sessions with our members, someone mentioned uh, what's the best way of actually straightening her, an, her, a horizon um, in a ski, seascape and landscape image. Okay, So what I've done is I've chosen a very minimalistic um, seascape images, uh, one that I took back in November at Penman um, Black Point on Anglesey. Okay? And as you can see, the image is, is fairly wonky. OK, so the, uh, the the horizon's not straight at all. I have altered this, by the way. I don't usually um, have wonky horizons too much these days. Um, but uh, for the purposes of demonstration, I've actually altered this picture. So the horizon is, is slightly wonky. OK, um, I'm going to show you both methods. I'm going to show you Lightroom and I'm also going to show you Photoshop as well on how to straighten in both both uh, both of these tools. OK. So what we'll do is we'll very quickly uh, go up to the crop overlay tool here in, in Lightroom and we'll just click that, okay? And below it, what we'll do is it then brings up um, this tool here, which is the straightening tool, okay? It looks like a ruler. And then what we'll do is we'll go to the very left of the image. Again, this is my workflow. There's numerous ways that you can straighten a horizon, but this is my workflow, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to center my cursor where the uh, sea meets the uh, sky, okay, the horizon. I'm just going to click, and I'm also going to drag that uh, ruler right away to the right hand side. I'm going to basically do the same again and just get the horizon and the sky in that circle to the right hand side and let go of my cursor let go of my mouse and there is a straightened perfectly straightened um, horizon in Lightroom okay let's just do that one more time okay so there we have it um, I'm going to click the crop overlay tool and I click the horizon I'm going to go to the left click once holding down all the way to the left, all the way to the right, get it centered and release the mouse. And there we have it. Press enter. You've got a perfectly straight horizon shot or horizon now. OK, so if we go into Photoshop, OK, again, I've slightly exaggerated the, um, the horizon here. It's really, really wonky. OK, and what we'll do is we'll go down to this tool here, which is the crop tool. OK, and again, much like photo, uh, much like Lightroom, should I say, it brings up a little straightening panel here, a little straightening tool. OK, so what we'll do is we'll click that. OK, it's a little bit different than, um, than Lightroom. And we're just going to center that on the horizon. And again, it actually tells you the degrees by which you were out. OK, and I'm going to center that there. 1.5 degrees, which is the um, the amount that it was out by. Press enter, and it's perfectly perfectly straight. Okay, let's just do it one more one more time. Let's make it really wonky this time. It does actually crop in uh, once um, once you actually straightened it, so you will lose some of your picture. Okay, but um, if you're out by you know half a half a degree or one degree, it's not going to be too much. OK, so we'll click the crop again, click the straighten tool and there we go. And I'm going to center on the far left hand side of the screen on the horizon. Click once, holding the tool down on the horizon. She's out by seven degrees now and it's going to crop in once you. There we go. Perfectly straight shot. Once again. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click like and remember to subscribe to Chorley Photographic Society. Thank you.